Islam haters, please open know the Quran the... and read the Quran before having any opinions about anything. Absolutely. Now, let's carry open, on. read, and, find and the details. Open mind, open and, learn, mind. and come to a conclusion yourself. Yeah, yeah. Open mind, okay. learn, find the conclusion. Good. I believe Jesus is God. So I am a sh I am a person with shirk. So I am a corrupter. Yeah. What do you? We should kill you now. You see? Yeah. You see the point? We kill him. <laughs> so we no. This is this is not a joke. I know. I know. I'm Okay, let's well, start again. What do you want to do? Well, you Let me ask you a very simple question. Yeah? Islam is a religion of violence. Do we agree? This has nothing to do with the argument. No, Go back Can to we? Go. This is very important. I will not answer this. What, what I, I'm I talking about right now is violence. very, very important. It's not. Do we agree that Islam no, is a religion of violence? We are not going to go over religion here. We are going to go over facts. Do we agree or not? No, no, no. How many Muslims? Uh, so you are. Uh, so on what basis are you saying Islam is not a religion of violence? Come on, man. On what basis are you saying Islam is not a religion of violence? It's in the Quran multiple times, more than the violent chapters, like by ten so times. That don't kill anyone if you murder which, one which person. Chapters, ten oh, times you're saying this is surprising to me. <laughs> very, very, very surprising. But do you do we first of all let's begin with a simple agreement? Could you please come here? Let's begin with a simple agreement. Do we agree? Do we agree? Do we agree? Wallahi is a coward. Thank you, thank you. He's a coward, he's a man. Wallahi, wallahi, listen, please, please. You're a coward, man. Do we do we agree? One second. Can you please I'm trying to uh one second, a little bit please. Just a little thank you very much. So uh what so do we at least agree that there are many, many chapters in the Quran which are violent chapters? Do we agree on that? Um, talking about war and stuff like that? Yeah. 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 Uh, one of the basic tenets of Islam is that Muslims should fight you for mean, Islam. You mean five pillars? You mean basic tenets? I'm going, I'm going with Quran right now. Quran. Quran. Okay. Are you an Arabic speaker? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You yeah, yeah. So you've, and have no, you... No, no, you're talking to the right person. I'll, I'll answer. How, how, how old are you? 23. 24, so you've read 24 this month, but it doesn't matter. So, so you've read the Quran multiple times in your own mother tongue. I've read it. So and we both can agree English Arabic, but you read Arabic too, you are an Arabic speaker also. Can we both very quickly agree there are many, many chapters in the Quran which seriously advocate that if you want to be a sincere Muslim, you need to be violent. Do we agree on this? Incorrect. On what basis are you saying this? Are you are you saying such a passage doesn't murder, exist? If you murder one person, you, it's as if you killed the whole nation. Where, where is you that? You can ask where any is Muslim where is that? and they will know what to tell where you. Is any that? Muslim. Where is this? The, wherever it is. If, if you ask well, any you Muslim, brother, brother, any listen, Muslim listen, here, what does it say about killing someone? They will tell you, the first thing they will tell you is if you kill one Muslim, uh, one person is as if you killed an I'll entire I'll get the nation. verse for you, just to help you all. Beautiful. Great. I'll so, get the verse me, for thank you. you. Yeah. Show the camera as well. Yeah. I'll, I'll, no, don't worry, I'll put the verse up uh, yeah. on. Uh, yeah. Right. Yeah. So, Surah 5, Ayah 32. Yeah. Surah, uh, Surah, Al Surah Al Maida, Al Maida, yeah. Ayah 32, and let's read this. Re let's after, one second. Let's no read problem. this. Yeah, yeah, please. Step. Let's yeah, yeah. one step at a time. So is this, is this talking about the one nation thing that we just talked about right now? Is no, no. Uh, if you kill one person, then you're killing all everyone. Yeah, okay, the, the okay, verse right. that you quoted. Yeah, let's read. Is Surah. Not, one second, please. Surah 5, Ayah 32. For that cause, we decreed for the children of Israel that whoever kills a human being for other than killing or corruption in the earth, it would be as if he had killed all mankind. And whoever saves the life of one, it would be as if he had uh, saved the life of all mankind. With me? So far, this is what you wanted to quote, yeah? Can we please continue reading? Now, yeah. But firstly, shall we, shall we uh, uh, note carefully? Did you, get that? Did you get that, guys? Yeah, yeah. Did yeah, you yeah. get that? Uh, Very important. Let's get this. Islam so can we... Islam haters, please open the Quran this. and read the Quran before having any opinions about anything. Absolutely. Now, let's carry open, on. read, find and, and the details. Open mind, open and, mind. and come to a conclusion well, yourself. I, yeah, yeah. Open mind, okay. learn, Excuse find me. the conclusion. Excuse come to the con okay. conclusion. Uh, can I please move the camera? Sorry. Yeah. Sure, let's read this. So, Surah 5, Ayah 32. Can we first... Okay, maybe come over a little bit. So, can we please first of all agree 32. For that cause, we decreed for for who? The children of Israel. Do you see that? Well, well, well. Surah 5, Ayah 32. Yeah. So that whoever kills a human being, so that particular principle, whoever kills a human being, principle, Allah, Islamic Allah claims, was given to the where children of Israel. You read it from here. No, no, 532, Surah 532. No, no, no. Where you read that whole nation thing? You said you're going to go to the next here, verse. Here, here, here. So read that again and then keep Let's going. read that again yeah. and let's get the details. For that you cause, here, once and once. Yeah, I, I'll read again. Will. 
for that cause we decreed for the children of israel that whoever kills a human being for other than killing or corruption in the uh, earth it would be as if he had killed all mankind that's the same we read earlier yeah? right. and whoever saves the life of one it would be as if he had saved the life of all mankind we read this earlier can we agree that islamic allah says that's an instruction given to the children of israel yeah, yeah? Yeah, you said read it, read it properly, look, with open mind. Quran, yeah. Once, once, read it once, 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 just once. Again. We agreed earlier that we need to read it properly, with an open mind, read the details and conclude properly. Can we conclude this is not for the Muslims but for the children of Israel? Can we conclude? It says that right there. Yeah. Yeah. So this is not for Muslims. Muslims won't. What do you mean? It does. No, no, no. Decreed for the there. children of Israel. It does say it there, yeah. So this is for the children of However, Israel. However, no, 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 no. let's let's see let's see what uh, Muslims need to take seriously. We'll read that. Yeah. Right, One second. Um, whoever kills a human being for other than killing or corruption in the earth, I'd really like for you to note that carefully and then and then read further. It's for yeah. in Arabic. Yeah. Now let's read further. Our messengers came to them of old with clear proofs, but afterwards many of them became prodigals in the earth. The only reward of those who make war on Allah, war on Allah and his messenger and strive after corruption in the land will be that they will be killed or crucified. Yeah? Okay. For those who yeah, cause definitely. corruption, okay, definitely. for those who cause corruption, do you think Christians cause corruption? Some of them. Who are the Christians who cause corruption? The ones that cause corruption are the ones that cause corruption. Yeah, who are they? What is the Go corruption we're talking about? What are the what is the corruption we're talking about? That has caused corruption. Murder, theft, um, 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 un, un, uh, dishonesty, usury. example, usury, um, fraud, rape. Interesting, interesting. You have read the Quran. One second. You have read the Quran yourself. The Quran is very particular that there is one kind of worst corruption. Do you know what it is? Believing that there's no God. Believing what? Shirk, shirk. Shirk, very good. Great. And you think Christians commit shirk? No. Christians don't only, commit shirk? One second. What only, does the Quran say? Does the Quran let me, let me say? Land. Only the ones that believe that Jesus is God. Good. I believe Jesus is God. So I am a, I am a person with shirk. So I am a corrupter. Yeah, what do you. we should kill you now? You see, yeah, you see the point. We kill him. <laughs> so we no, this is this is not a joke. I know, I know. I'm just thinking where you want to go. No, no, it is a joke. No, no, it's this, funny. It's, it's funny because for you. You're still alive. No, one second. Maybe. That's why it's funny. No, no, no. I'm trying to. I'm trying to pop a bubble. I'm, I'm trying to pop a bubble in your head. I am not in Mecca in alive. Saudi Arabia. You're still alive. I'm not in Mecca. How, how many Christians have been? Where killed? are we alive? How where many am I alive? Christians have been killed due to this? Where am I alive? Due to this blasphemy that they're committing. Where am I alive? Christians are dying left, right, and center. Every Muslim. Muslim here has a sword. Where am I alive? Killed all Christians. We should kill all Christians. How many, how many Christians that's were killed by Muhammad and his army? Where is this happening? By Muhammad and his army, how Conquer. many Christians are killed? Crusades. Conquering. Look, Muhammad crusades. and his army. You want to talk about the Spanish Inquisition? Do you, do you have a hearing you issue? Want to talk about war do you suddenly have a hearing issue right now? I thought we were supposed to read, read. understand with an open mind, right. and stay, get to where the evidence leads us. Do we agree? We, we agree. Do we agree? We agree so we are. Well, we need to read, yeah, yeah, okay. understand, okay. find evidence, and go where the evidence leads us yeah, with yeah. an open mind. Yeah, yeah. We agreed. You said earlier Muslims think or Islamic theology is that Christians should not be killed. But where we have church, got to right now? One second. One second. Uh, one second. Can I can I finish my point? Uh, it's immoral. One. Yeah. Let me finish my point. Yeah. But we are. So you said Christians don't have to be killed by Islam. But we just read. No, the not, children not of Israel, are the not children. Killed. I'll take it one further. Christians are not killed in Islam. My dear friend, I'm not asking not for your. Should or shouldn't. Did or you earlier say read? Did you say this? Yeah. No, so I'm. A, w w w one second. Every Muslim has told you that there's Look, context. Why are you I'm trying to read? Can we read this? You're a, you're coming from the outside. You're an outsider. Can we read this right now? This religion, Do you have an open mind? And they say they make their own conclusions about Islam. Do you have an open mind? I'm trying to make you aware to a fact. But do you know? Do you have an there open mind? There's no context that everyone has been telling you for years. They say. Do you have an open mind? There's context in this verse. Do you have a well, mind at all? Whether it's open or closed. There. I don't know why. Why does it not enter? Do you have a mind at all? There's context in these words. You're smirking. Christians Do you have a mind alive. at all? Of course, I'm smirking. You know what you're talking about, and you know exactly what you're trying to hide. So you I'm, 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 so I'm perfectly convinced. Okay. Do you have you a mind at all? You don't believe what you're saying. Do you have a mind at all? You tell me. 
Well, you no, tell me. No, no, I don't. Okay, then, then okay. the conversation is over. It's very, very simple. No, you're asking, why, Did you not why, why earlier you say you need to have an open mind? Can we get an yeah, open yeah, yeah. mind right now? Yes, we can. Good, good. Ha, love, and love and what did you say with that we have to read with an open mind? Can we do that right now? Can, yeah. Cool. Shall we do that right now? Let's read, yeah. So let's read. So the first part we said are for the children of Israel. The first instruction, yeah? Mm -hmm. It's a couple of instructions for children of Israel. Now we are getting to instruction given to Muslims. The only reward for those who make war on Allah and his messenger and strive after corruption in the land will be that they will be killed or crucified or have their hands like and Jesus. feet or have their hands and feet on alternative alternate sides cut off or will be expelled from the land. Such will be their degradation in the world and in the hereafter theirs will be an awful doom. Shall we quickly agree, please? I don't want to waste time. You and I agreed. You said Christians commit shirk because anyone who calls Jesus is God is committing a shirk. It is the Quran. One second, one second. The Quran is very clear. This is the worst of shirks possible. You agree. So you are with an open mind. Please don't look somewhere else. You need to focus here. What we have read here is here. Please focus right now. Don't don't daydream and try to see how you can escape from where you're caught up. Please, one second. Can we agree? Can we agree? Whether you do it or not, you might be a lovely man, but a very bad Muslim. Can we best agree that the text says a Muslim who takes the Quran seriously, who has the guts to follow the Quran seriously, will end up, will need to fulfill what Islamic Allah himself has given as an edict here. Christians should be either killed or crucified or have their hands and feet on right, alternative sides question. cut off. No, let's conclude this and then you ask me a question. Do we agree a good okay, Muslim, a Osama bin Laden okay, okay. would be a good okay, Muslim. Do we agree? One second. Do we agree Osama you know, bin Laden you know, you know, is a good Muslim because he ends up killing Christians? You know, you know, 50, he ended up. Um, question. 50 years ago, 100 years ago, 100 years ago, there was a death penalty, right? There was a death penalty in this country and in the Are West. Are you talking about the UK right now? I am. We're talking about Islam. I am your UK question. wasn't Can governed you let me by Islam. In the way, I want to answer it, or do I have to follow? Do I'll give you two if minutes. You want, if you want to answer I'll it yourself, entertain you for two minutes. Talk to yourself. If you want to hear what someone else has sure. to say, let me. Speak. I'll entertain you for two minutes, okay. but if it's irrelevant to what we were talking okay. about, I'll bring you back to the subject. Perfect. Perfect. In this country and in other countries, there's a death penalty, and there's crimes raging from treason. Blasphemy. So if you say in some countries in the UK and like back in the day and in America, if you say something bad about the Queen, for example, they'll hang you. And that's the Queen. That's a human being. There's laws against theft. There's laws against murder. There's laws against blasphemy, as I said. So when the Quran comes along and does rules that are followed, you're saying this now. You have the luxury of saying this now because right now this country has become secular where they don't believe in killing anyone. You're waffling on right now. Can we please quickly agree? What does secular whatever mean? Race, whatever secular means one they second. don't follow the word of God one second. as law. I don't consider it's the Quran the to be the word of God at all. But let's, let's come there. Let's so this book here says that the word of God is law because it's not secular. You're, you're, giving so, a, you're giving an excuse and then a reason. I'm, not giving an excuse. I'm, I'm focused I'm on the conclusion I'm first. Because you're saying. Do we both agree that the Quran. You're pinpointing Islam and you're saying Islam is like this. I'm telling you, the whole Islam. world is like this. It's only now you have the luxury to look at Islam with a magnifying glass and say, look at this book, what it's saying. Look, I'm saying can we agree? This is the new. You're waffling on right now. Can we agree? Can we agree? Because you started off somewhere else. Now you are being defensive. No, saying, you are being, being defensive. defensive. Can we as very quickly agree? Can hear me, I'm happy cause Absolutely. Because you're being defensive. Absolutely. You're actually being Can we please you're not being quick? To what okay. I'm saying. Uh, that's thank, thank you very much. All right. Can we please very quickly agree? The Quran is extremely clear. The Quran. Uh, whatever. Has, excuse me. Let me finish. Let me finish, please. Yeah, yeah. Whatever excuse you give, God, that you. whatever excuse you give. The Quran is extremely clear for whoever takes the Quran seriously, i.e. a faithful Muslim, when they find a Christian, a Christian who considers Jesus to be God, who is who a Christian is, you are supposed to kill them, crucify them, or chop their hands on the alternative sides. You've also been, can I, can I, can I, can I please tell you one more thing? Can I please tell you one more thing? The Quran also says, the Quran also says, if it is convenient for you, be the Quran, the Quran, Listen, be the Quran also no, no, no. says, be open if it is not Everyone convenient no. for you to tell the Why truth, do you still want to lie. That? Why do you still want to Are you, have you heard of this word humans? called takia? 
No, this is we don't believe this. You don't believe it's in Takia? Haram to lie. It's haram to lie. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That says it all. It's Islamic it's theology. And that'll be another story, Rail. Thank you very much. Lovely to speak to you. Listen, thank you. Yeah. <coughs> God's blessings. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hey, hey. Muslims. Good to see you. God's blessings. Muslims. Muslims are liars, big time. Like how you have demonstrated yeah, right now. Thank you very much. Guys.